Now, I honestly, we, nobody wants to wait on you. We're asking you nicely. We'll be very nice. Oh, this is a nice place, actually. You got a cup of coffee out of us. What more do you want? That's it. I'm not, you're not gonna call me a Ooh. I'm gonna sit here my boss's wife. You're not gonna call people a lesbian and sure as hell ain't gonna look at a girl. Well, you can't, you can't just get, there's nothing wrong with, I mean, YouTube's not gonna let me say it because they're probably thinking I'm being derogatory, but there's nothing wrong with outright saying the word lesbian. However, she's using that term in a derogatory sense. And that's not a rap, partner. You can't do that. I don't know why I got all Arthur Morgan there. I don't hold the Let's, let's go. go, yes, let's go. Get her out of there. Get out of here. You deserve to be locked up in Bellevue. Oh. And that's all I got to say. And I'm asking you nicely. Are you surprised? Uh, looks like a nice restaurant, nice spot. Get out of there. Get out of there. And honestly, you know what? The employee handled that very well. I get nothing because of what? Because you're being disrespectful. I haven't said anything to you guys, but you were talking to us disrespectfully i'm sure they're gonna post this on tiktok we can know about taco bell this is taco bell and erlanger this ain't erlanger bro. This what is, is this Paris. dixie dixie highway y'all i know i live here babes and i also live in la don't do too much because you can get sued so who are you talking to so i don't know what it was that this guy said prior to filming but clearly it must have been something bad to get this dude that freaking rattled like unless this guy just behind the drive-thru is that way which would just be like horrible which would actually be horrible customer service like that then you're totally in the wrong i'm talking to you you, you are because oh, i'm a customer i haven't done anything to you and i'm no. not moving out of this line i'm not you're not a customer because you're not getting nothing in my drive through yeah go oh yeah who do we need to speak to what's the what's your uh corporate 1-800 get the out of my drive through oh Oh, damn, he's coming with the zingers at the end. But also, like, side tidbit, anecdote thing, whatever. Um, I've actually never been to Taco Bell before, guys. That is, like, one of the only fast food places that I've never, ever been to. That's not a glowing endorsement from what I just saw. But comment down below, if I was to go, what is the one thing that I have to get if I was to go to Taco Bell? I want to know. Hold on. Watch no, this. no, no. No, say that. Uh, so you spit my food, right? You going to say that, kid? Nah. Tell me you spit my food on camera. Oh, he's the employees that clap back. I did. Oh, I don't food. say that. Come on, let's go to the police station. Yeah, spitting in food, don't do that. Then you get in trouble. Then you're gonna be in behind bars. Then you're gonna have to better call Saul. You know what I mean? Yeah, just don't do that. That's a scrub. There's nothing else. Short video, short response. Don't spit in people's food. Say nice word, I will let you leave. I'll let Just nice word. Not that kind of word. Yeah, I'll call you can't so well kind of say that. Baby, I'm so sorry that you messed up my nails. Not that I'm, that I'm, I'm so sorry that they are wrong. And I wanted them to get fixed and they're not getting fixed. I apologize for coming in there and being rude, but I'm leaving and I'm going to have you out. Don't you You talk nicely. I'll let you leave. You talk that kind of, I won't let you leave. I just said sorry. And bring my chair back to where it belongs. Fake apology not accepted. Okay, yeah, you know what? I see where this guy's coming from. I get it. You're gonna act like a child, you're gonna be treated like a child. That means pick up the chair you threw down. Move my chair back to the top. What, what chair. is that chair too? Oh, you see? You can say that, mother. You mother. He he says I'm not gonna let you out if you don't behave yourself. Now, however, I don't know if you can keep someone in that might be, you know what I mean? Not even a little bit. Unless they've like committed a crime or stolen something, I don't know. You gotta be careful these days. You, you never know, you know what I mean? You laugh about this situation? What's the situation? You get paid to do a job, do your job. And you went to customer service and you found help, no? no? I didn't. You didn't find help? Here we go. I didn't go to customer service. So you what shouldn't tell your customers to go to customer service. You should get your lazy ass on the phone. And the phone was on I'm... and the phone was an answer. Complain to this guy right here, what you said to me. That nobody answers the phone, that you can't get assistance when you're back here because nobody answers. And that is answers. correct. I want to know, like, was it her job to answer the phone? Is that what it is? And if that is your job, I guess you should do it. The phone, I will that's call again. That's not my problem. And that's not my problem that it the is. phone you're doesn't employee, answer. You're an employee. you got a problem with the way it's operating. You need to go to your manager you're and customer. discuss it with him. Not tell your customer to go to customer service and then stand there with that little smirk on your face thinking this 
That is, that is quite the smirk. She does have quite the smirk there. But also, I don't know. This is why this is the title of this video. We got entitled Karens and other entitled Karens, and they're battling, guys. Yo, comment down below. Who do you have winning that round? I think, honestly, the co-worker might have won just because of the smirk at the end. But, like, it was close. Like, there was, there was back and forth hands the whole time. Go to hell. Him down, so. Go to hell. She throw the money under the table. Yeah, I apologize. Suppo supposed to be like this? See, look, see that, see that, see that? You see that? Uh-huh. See that? See that? That see woman what? just speaking. You need a job? Get out of here, okay? Okay, you better calm down. Calm down, calm down. I guess cashier threw some uh, threw some coinage at him. Threw some didn't like him. Threw some coinage at him. Ah, it's hard to it's but there's no I, I didn't I didn't see the crime. You know I didn't see the heinous act. No, it's hard it's hard to tell the context. I mean I'm I'm assuming this is the employees doing nice doing naughty stuff, but I don't really know. I can't tell. Not a lot of context of that one. Starbucks, love it. We love it. Excuse me. Yes. yes. Hi, yes. Um, I would like some extra whipped cream. I clearly didn't get that here. I think that was a bit. That wasn't real. That was a bit. They know each other. I just, I already filled it up to the top. No, but can I please get more? Because it's clearly not at the top. Yeah, sure. I'm, as an actor and con oh, comedian, sometimes I can, I can tell what's fakey eggs and bakey. And I think that one put a stamp on it. Boom. That's... That one's achy, fakes, and not real, that one. Nope. Oh. Megaphone. Uh oh! Now, since you're Oh, recorded, boy. You have it on record that you've been asked I am recording. And, and you know what else was on record? The telephone call. Because there was, there was no reason for you to be that brutal and nasty. Police know. Why did they have... Why did they have the megaphone? What, does that happen all the time? <laughs> That's fine. But if you are asked to leave, that's and we fine. have witnesses. That's yeah. fine. Welcome on this premises. That's fine. She is calling right now. She can call the police. Okay. She can call the police. And, and what's your name, sir? None of your are you a manager here? Do you have to wee wee wee? Would you do that all the time, my dude? I, I I I I've seen a lot of things in my time, but that's a new one. The megaphone from the dollar store. That's a new one. <laughs> but what is it supposed to do though? Chase people off or like that wouldn't. Ineffective. I don't know. Get find better, better to no. Did Sonia get back to you yet? Has Sonia gotten back to you at all? Or are you just not going to answer? Because I would like to be able to get in my room and my cat and make sure that she's Where okay. Where are we? I do not have to pay ninety-one seventy because we were charged for Saturday, and that's what we were told. Yeah, that's, that's not cool. Uh, honestly, okay, like, I didn't even think that the person behind the camera here is a Karen if what she's saying is true. And you what? won't talk to your general manager to find this out. Instead, you call the police. You're and then you me. tell me that I'm a bitch. Either way, like, my dude's just giving her the full-on silent treatment. Like, she's trying to figure out, like, what is what right now. And then, like, the whole, like, 90, 70 or whatever it was. You called me a <laughs> You called me a a customer, a bitch, and you have terrible customer service. Like she was super calm that whole time. And if this guy's just like, you bitch, like, you're out, you gotta pay for this thing. Like, okay, well, I'm gonna be pretty upset about that as well. Like, it sounds like she's trying to get her animal, I think. Like, I think her animal is staying there. Like, maybe this is like a pet thing, like the overnight pet thing or something. I'm not really sure, but. Please. Give me my money. No, you won't give me my money. Give me my money. You won't get you. I'm gonna. Oh! Okay? Give me my money. Give me my money and I got the video of what you did. Of you cussing at no, me and No, and what people? you did to my food. You what you did? No, you didn't. Food. I told you you didn't wash your hands. Well, if I yeah. find this anywhere you move, online, what you gonna do? I will sue you. Okay, yeah, good. I'm glad you got it on Okay, video yes. <laughs> okay. No, you are, because you in my How business. You, you in my you business. Because they making my food. She making my food in the in the dirty sink. And you saying I'm causing problems. You, no, you are, and you are, and you, you are. are okay. Question. I didn't even get a chance to get a word in. I didn't even get a chance to say anything. She might be in the wrong though. I don't know. Like, did, but then the I'm gonna sue. You. Like again, d don't say anything. Don't say anything until you're in the court. Don't say nothing. Nobody. No how. No way. Just 
Um, but I hope you're not making the food dirty sink. I hope that's not true. I'm, I'm gonna say it's not. This actually looks like a pretty clean Domino's though. Or this looks like actually a pretty clean place. This looks like a pretty uh, neat and tidy place. So it, I don't think they would. You know, you, you never really know. Uh, but then to go after the customers though is the, is the lady holding the phone. I mean, that's just kind of, that's not it, is it? I talked to the chief, that's just not it. You can't go after them too. I mean, I don't, I don't go after anybody, but what do you, what do you just sit down, eat your pizza, that's it. Enjoy your pizza. I don't know. You know what I say, I ain't fat him. Did I fat him? I ain't fat him. Take, take, take the ass off, your mama bitch, your baby bitch, and your mother now kiss my yeah, I don't even know what the heck they're arguing about at the top. They're just like cussing each other out ridiculously. I love the end of that clip. Like my dude's just like, listen, I just need to get my hamburger and my chicken nuggets. That's it. And the person's like, one second, like we can make that work, you know. At the end of the day, that is probably well, not to that extent, but I could understand being upset if I don't get my chicken nuggets. Like I need my nuggets, dudes. You know what I'm saying? Now I honestly, no nobody wants to wait on you. We're asking you nicely. We'll be very nicely. Please leave. Oh. Okay, you know what? She is asking him nicely. That is very fair. I'm not. You're not gonna call me. You're not gonna sit down my boss's wife. You're not gonna call people a lesbian. You're not gonna do that. Girl. I don't look at other girls. Let's go. Yeah. Yeah. You deserve to be locked up in Belgium. Okay, well, <laughs> I don't know about that one, but. <laughs> And my dude's still sitting there. My dude's still going like, what, what did I do? Like, I think that she just told you, man. I think that she just said, you're not allowed to call people those names and you got a dip. My guy's like, what do you mean? Like, I can do whatever I want. Not in this restaurant, Bo. Yeah, I think that that lady 1000% deserves a raise. And this was very well done, I will say. I, I applaud the person applauding this. Because yeah, this was this was well handled, you know. Like you told him what was what, and said like what was right, what was not right here, and like you got a dip. So respect. I love how slow he's like. <sighs> Boom. That weight too. I have to get a good burger too. <laughs> yep. That's fantastic. That is fantastic. Like that's the thing with Karen's Diner, their food has to be amazing. Like no pressure, but like if your service is intentionally <laughs> your food has to be so good where you're like, okay, it's worth it. But also this guy's so funny. This is like low key a dream job. Just go over and be like, hey, milkshake, awesome. Be so moody and you could just oh, lean into it. That's so funny. Everyone loves it too. They're all just filming. Oh, I like this place. I like this one. Thank you. Good. Oh, Good. oh, come on. Oh. Now get the my drive through. Whoa. Record that. She did, yeah. What are you doing, lady? What are you doing? Like, how did you get to this level of frustration? <laughs> Yeah, you can't record What are you doing? You can record me. You now just curse me out up and down. We recording each other, now what? I wanna see the moment before here, guys, because right now, it looks very one-sided. It's like the person behind the camera is just chilling. They were just trying to get their drive-through order, and then you are losing it. Like, you are absolutely losing it. Obviously, there was some reason, something that went down for the person in the car to pull out the camera as they did. I wanna know what the heck that was, guys. Comment down below if you've seen the beginning of this clip, because that was, that was nuts, dude. That was nuts at the end. They are all over his bag. Oh, what do we got going on? What are those? That is, that is what ridiculous. are those? They're everywhere. Look, they're all on the ground, too. That's what the hell is all that? On the ground around that? What is it? He's just trying to cut concrete over there. I don't. What is it? <laughs> I'm so glad I'm not that right now. That guy. Do it. I'd be throwing up. I, you know what? I'm what so is it? Sorry, guys. That is just bizarre. Like, what are those freaking bugs? I have no idea what those bugs are, guys. Um, but it's like, they are not nice. Like, they are big. They are sizable. Either they're massive flies. They could be bees. They could be wasps. Like, they even, like, I don't think that they could be locusts. But it's like, they, like that's what they look like. Like, giant. Like, wh where did these things come from? You know, like, literally, it's like, holy crap. Like, you are getting annihilated. That is when I quit. 
that's literally when I'm just like, I can't do this right now. We need an exterminator to come in here. We need to deal with this right now. And I used to work, uh, like I did lawn care for a while uh, one summer when I was in university. I also did, I worked on a golf course. And it's like, you had to deal with bugs 100%. But that is bad. That is really bad. This is so funny. She's so good. <laughs> that is so funny. I love that. Yes, okay, yes. These dudes walking in, laugh, they're like, let's do it. I'm so pumped. Can you, like, not film me without my permission, please? I get Karen's coffee, please. Oh, my God. Thanks for covering my face. I love, I love where we've got to from like human beings. You know what I mean? Like, I'm old school. I remember listening to like Dane Cook make the Karen joke. The first Karen joke. He's the OG. No one's gonna forget this. I'm not letting anyone forget this. But he made the first one and then now there's restaurants. And we've established like a new category of awful people. And it's the best. I love it. I love it. No way. Yo, that's actually hilarious if that's the case, man. Like, that's how you get, you know, I've always been saying, if you're at a job right now, you need to get a raise. It's like, you've been working there for a minute. The way that you get the raise, everybody's got to walk out. If everybody walks out, it's like, what are they going to do? Like, we have nobody right now. Like, we'll give you what you want. Not that you're probably going to get a raise at McDonald's anyways, but like, whatever, dude. That was funny. That made for a good TikTok. No. That's too many! That's too much! Dude, my guy's biceps and forearms. Like, that is that is full up strength right there. Like, did you see that right at the end? Like, it, that's all, like, right up in here, guys. Like, bicep and forearm. Like, those are powerful. Honestly, my dude doesn't need a pay raise. He needs a career change. I don't want this guy in, like, professional lifting or, like, arm wrestling or something. That is very impressive. Oh my god. I heard about these bags. These are the best. What did this one say? First one said it should have swallowed a little bit. Oh, I can read that one. It's too fast. These are so inappropriate. Okay, yeah, it's pretty inappropriate. I don't know. This is amazing. Nice. The non-verbal, yeah, I love that. Extra napkins, coming up hot, there you go. Boom, it's like a gentleman's club in LA at 2 a.m. Toss them up, like Cardi B in her old days. Throw them right up. Uh, yeah, I, I love this place. I love how people have just accepted and we're leaning into it. This is great, this is where we should be for all the things. Pissing off older white women in the meantime, let's do it. Should I do it before or after? I don't know. I think before, because she'll notice the camera. All right, you ready? Yeah, I'm ready, man. The camera's been rolling. Okay. What are we doing, man? What are we doing? Oh. Go. Oh. Whoa. Oh. Yo, yo, yeah. I mean, okay. Well, definitely do not be throwing stuff on people there. Like that is very questionable for sure. But like the hog, actually, that whole thing is questionable, man. She's just trying to work the drive-through. Like I know you were trying to prank her and everything like that, but like. Still, dude, like, I feel for these people. It's like, that's minimum wage, it's McDonald's, it's just like, but you shouldn't have thrown a drink on him too. Like, ah, dude, we, we're in a moral gray area. We're in a moral gray area here, folks. Moral gray area, moral gray area. Tough to say. Angry customer lose because order was five minutes late. They, I wanna be gone, but she said to go, like, we didn't get the order. Okay, you're so, so sorry. <laughs> 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 Should I call the police? Like, I think that would be helpful. <laughs> oh, man. <laughs> oh, God. Maybe you should get a hamburger next time. Get out of here, lady. Get out. <laughs> Yo, I just like, like, at the beginning of that clip, I just got this image of this, like, just like, yappy, like, dog, like, gremlin creature. Just like, bah, 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 bah. like, just like, no, bad dog. <laughs> You know, it's just like, stop it. Your order is five minutes late, lady. Like, relax, okay? You're gonna get your freaking food. You're gonna be another store that's closed down in the you mall. Closed down the mall? Yeah. Yeah. I don't 
Who the malls are the way? I love malls. My name is Mark. Hi, Mark. I don't give a maker. Get out and go by. Get out and go by. I love it. And this is New Square. It's New Square. Facebook. It is. I love how you start recording after you don't got rude with me and everything and try to like back I've never cussed at you. After I done told you the policy. You're a month late. You started recording after. Oh. Oh. Just he, he just said it. He took the words right out of my mouth. Go away. I don't care. I'm trying to tell you. No, we're not going to take your stuff back. No, we're not going to exchange. I don't care about your personal life story. I don't care that you feel I'm being rude to you. I don't. My man. My man, singing from the rooftops, baby. What a hero. So, you, Mark of New Square One, or whatever it was called, I salute you, sir. God bless you, and Godspeed. The fact of the matter this is. This is the first know. that I've ever been informed. Nobody informed me I'm when I first started. I'm informing you now. That, and it's that cool. is not, no, that is not copacetic. That's not copacetic. That's not a good reason. When I first started. No religion, no politics. When I first started a job. It's expected yeah. that somebody gives me all the rules and regulations and policies, and I sign those. Okay. You didn't sign so, anything. Exactly. No one signs anything. I didn't sign no, any. I didn't sign anything saying that I would agree Will you to not to say my rules or not. No. Agree to what? I don't know what we're talking about. Okay. I, <laughs> I don't know what they're talking. Listen, listen. If you're gonna take a video of something happening, I gotta have. Listen, the Domino's pizza lady. She was angry. She was mad. But she said it. She said, "You're making the, the food the sink. It's dirty. What are you doing?" I understood what she was talking about, or I at least had context. This guy's arguing with something over em, em, employees or something, but they didn't give any context. Something he didn't sign. I, I need more. I need more investigation. I need more information to make and my, put my points together. So. That's not customer service when somebody lives oh. 130 miles away. I know. I, I tell you, when I walk out of this damn bank, I'm going to get on Twitter. I'm going to blast the hell out of J.P. Morgan. Well, you don't take cash, cash at the cash bank? Thing. That's the most stupidest thing I've ever heard. Why that's the thing. Like, your entire business is money, and you're just, like, not accepting this form of money? Like, well, I feel that way? And that's crazy. It's crazy. Somebody walks in the customer and gets cash, and you won't take it. And you won't make an exception. Oh, boy. Lady, I don't care who the you call. This is ridiculous not to take cash on the. Uh, wow. Okay, so, uh, like, obviously, this guy's like a bit out of line. But I will say, if that's a bank and they're not taking cash, then, like, what are you doing? You know, like, why is that the policy, guys? Like, I don't understand. I know the cash isn't as big as it used to be, but still, like, you're not gonna take it? It's a freaking bank. Damn, that's weird. Go ahead. Oh, oh Subway. Go ahead, man. Swabway. Go ahead, you, man. Came out this, you came out, you started right. talking crazy to me. I didn't become rude to you. Okay, all right. Right over. Right. Just right, man. get your sandwich right. and get out. It's simple. Sorry, but, uh, you know, I pity you. You have to be. All right, all right, hold on a minute, hold on a minute. Pull back the books, hold on one second. If you're gonna take someone down because they're not the CEO of a company or they're not making gazillion billion dollars and you're, you're gonna come in there, you're gonna just pull the chair chair from underneath the guy? Man, you got some serious problems at home, buddy. That, that ain't right. But uh, I, hey, that's why you work in this job. But what? again, I'm a high school student, brother. <laughs> oh. That's the only reason I'm working in this job. All right, okay. I'm going to college. Yeah. Peace out. And the fact that the guy says too, he says, I'm in high school, dude. Which, you know what, that used to happen to me a lot too. I used to work in a place that wasn't exactly desirable. It was a high school job. I can't help that I look like I'm 35 when I was 16. I can't help that, that's just how it goes. Sometimes I'd show up to places to meet my friends or I'd go meet their parents and they'd be like, okay, nice to meet you. Why is there an adult here? They would be very confused. It's just the way I look, it happens, that's okay. But you can't do that, brother, you can't. That's so rude, that's so, oh. That actually made me mad when he said that. My blood is boiling. I'm asking for a bottle of water and they won't give me a big bottle of water. They won't let me buy a big bottle of water. Sir, I don't think you're gonna be happy with us today. Maybe we should take another I flight. love Delta, I've had a great experience. I mean, she's, she's just clapping. She's just, no, no, no. Lots of money at Delta. I want a bottle of water. I'll buy one or I'll get one. Either way, I just want a bottle of water. I don't see how this is a big problem. It's water. It's not like vodka. It's just yeah, but you're not allowed to have water bottles on the airplane, are you? 
Another thing? I'm very calm. I just want I will, water. I will land the airplane middle of this country, have you removed by police if I have to. I feel like you're not allowed to have water bottles in airplanes. Is that a thing? I don't, I've never been on an airplane before. I don't know. Is that? Th I feel like there's something like, can you have more than four ounce of liquid on here? Some stupid, something stupid like that. I don't know. I, I don't fly. I, I'm, not, I'm not sure. But um, large, and he keeps saying, large, I, I, there's something not right there though. The why? Why she's getting so a lot of this? A lot of it might be because something happened before. Just saying. Oh. Oh. Oh, oh, damn. What is happening? Damn, like that is a, we call the police and get these human beings like out of here. Oh man, wow, we are just, this is turning into something, wow, okay, it just keep, I guess we're just keep going. Wow. This is not cool, like this is a police situation for sure, and this isn't even entitled versus, like entitled Karens versus entitled Karens or whatever, like this is just, two horrible individuals. Now starting with the customer, I think, because the customer did throw that stuff first, but then like the guy behind the counter, like you don't need to be throwing it back at her. Like you already know that that's gonna antagonize her even more. Like I know I know it's hard to take the high road in that situation, you're getting stuff thrown at you, but still. She's not getting on this so let's just talk about the other well, I'm, I'm trying to figure out, it was two minutes. I don't understand why two minutes. I'm telling you right now, you have a bag, these are the rules. It's 40 minutes. You should always check what the cutoff time is for every airport. There's traffic in LA. It's a busy airport. What more do you want me to say? Dude, if you sh if you didn't show up early to LAX, what are you talking? I've never been in an airport and I know that you got to show up early to LAX, dude. What do you mean? Okay. So now the next option. I, I mean, was, that's just kind of it. Um, 166 to upgrade to first class if you want to guarantee it. I'll look at the JFK flights and see the next flight to JFK only has one seat available. I don't think she was clapping back there. I don't think the employee was rude. She's kind of just saying it. it. And if this is LA, that's that that might be. Somebody gotta Google that. Put it up here somewhere. That might be. That might be the bit busiest airport on planet Earth. It could be. It's gotta be top ten at least. It's one of the biggest cities in the world. How like how do you show up late to that? He's saying two minutes, but I, I don't know. I don't know. And he's flying to New York, probably the second busiest. Airport in New York. So yeah, probably not a lot of seats left, dude. I don't know. I don't know what's there's something fishy about that one too. A lot of weird stuff happening today. I don't know. It's weird. It's a weird. It's a weird day. Go to school, two kids, all cop, all house, cop pay, come on, right? Yeah, step this. I done came around you. I done showed you what I was doing. You ain't do nothing. You ain't do nothing. You mom, you right? What I gotta do? You mom, what I gotta do? You mom, what you gotta do? You mom, like I thought. You mom, yeah, like I thought. You mom, worried about the job. Um. Excuse me, ladies. You mom. What I gotta do? Uh, you mom. What I gotta do? You mom. You make some shit. You mom. Like I thought. Is that okay? You mom. You're mom. You're mom. I get off at three o'clock. You're mom. I get off at three o'clock. I'm here. I'm here now. I get off at three o'clock. I'm here now. And I get off at three o'clock. I'm here now. Uh, I didn't. I caught some of it. She. I, she said, "What are y'all gonna do?" Uh, and then she said, "I get off at three o'clock." And when someone says they get off at three. You know it's about to go down, brother. I don't know. I hope I hope that ended peacefully and there was no violence because I don't like that. But uh, she said she got off at three. This is a whole, I got a bird. <laughs> she said she got off at three, so I don't know. I hope that ended well. No, no, no. I want to talk to your manager now. You're going to get in trouble and she's going to get in trouble. Oh, okay, you, you don't think so. For what? For what? Customer service. You know, every every company has to have good customer service. Wait, there's two workers right now? One should always be here. One should always be there. You're a manager? <laughs> you, you think I don't know how business works? No. I take right, business so this, classes. Nah. Only we to make a change. I take, I take business classes. Okay. So oh, you think I'm come on. Sure. No. No, 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 no. No, I should know that. I should know that. How you arrogant know. can you be? Yeah. yeah. You should know that. You should know. No. He said probably the worst. He, he probably said the worst things you could say to somebody working behind the counter. Uh, one, you you don't know good you don't know good customer service. There should always be people. Here. There should always be someone here and someone there. Uh, yeah, you're you don't you don't run this place, dude. You don't get to decide who who what where when why and sometimes how. You don't get to do that. Uh, also, too, when he said, "I know how things work. I go to business school." Okay, let me put this in perspective for everybody. Remember back in school when you were a kid and you were in math class? Were you the best at math? Nah, you weren't, because you were learning. So you're not that good at math. If you came up to a grade grade four me and be like, wow, that kid's big. But if you came up to grade four me and you, Adam, stop laughing at that. That's 
and if you come up the grade for me and you and you said, hey man, can you solve can you solve this uh this oh uh, can you solve for the slope y equals mx b plus c whatever that actually no can you do a squared equals b squared equals c squared that's grade for me I can't do that even though as hard as I try even though I'm learning math I can't do that because I'm not there yet I don't know everything yet so when you say I'm in business school I know to me it just sounds like you don't know and clearly from your actions you don't know it's just kind of kind of ignorant isn't it. And they treat me like. What you're doing right now is wrong, okay? What Just did I do wrong? Sit in the chair, let him take you up to your room. Fuck okay. you. That's my point. Whoa. Oh. Oh. Um, Look, lady, oh. I'm the red skin. I didn't do anything you're wrong. You're gonna go viral? <laughs> what? <laughs> okay, what does what does being a Republican have to do with anything? <laughs> I don't give a f What did I do wrong? <laughs> What you're, did I do wrong? You're just acting a little bit like weird right now. I didn't do anything I'll, I'll wrong. Did it, did it. What did I do wrong? What did I do wrong? Well, I, okay, I, I don't know what you did wrong either, it. but <laughs> yeah, yeah. Okay, I don't know what it is that you did wrong either here, lady. But like, like sailing people that you're a Republican and like pushing them away and stuff like that. I don't think that this is helping the situation. Like, her, obviously, that has no bearing on this conversation at all. Like, I, I don't know what it was that you did. Clearly, it was something weird if they're like having to literally escort you out of the freaking building. See, like, it's still service, it's still a busy restaurant with service. This is chaos. I honestly like it's fun, but like, man, I bet those servers are like, yo, I actually want to rip table 13. I actually want to rip their heads off. So I don't know what to do about this. But then you're just looking into the character more, right? Like, what a dream scenario. I've served at numerous restaurants. It's horrible. People talk to you like, I wish I could come out and be like, and just walk away. I wish I could tip ketchup on things, but here you go. Why didn't you order it then? Uh, there you go. Now you just do it. You get tip for it. It's pretty sick. We have a nice system. We've created a nice system. I'm gonna keep doing this. Hey, I have a question. Is your manager here? Manager? Yeah. Yeah. Can hey. I talk to him? John. Please. We're at the McDonald's. We're going to show him what happened. What happened? John. What went down, dude? Going to get John. Yeah. We're waiting. <laughs> Wait, that was it? That was it? Was this the manager? Was he John? I'm confused, dudes. Did you see that, Chris? No. No, yeah. Okay, apparently, like, dude in the car said, can I speak to your manager? And then this guy, maybe this guy is the manager. He's like, yo, John, John, where are you at? But it's like he was just going to look for the manager. If he's not the manager, he's asking where John is. Unless he was the manager, in which case, I guess he'd had enough. I don't know, man. I'm confused about that one. I feel like the comments are going to let me know that I missed something, but... Let me do it. Let me know what I missed. I, I just want to get my that. food. No, <laughs> All right. Whoa. Wow, this one employee is dealing with it. I feel for you. Like it's McDonald's, dude. Who cares? It's straight up McDonald's, lady. Like whatever. Like what? What do you expect? Their service is not good at McDonald's. Newsflash, it's not that good. It's a fast food restaurant. Yeah, I can understand complaining if you paid like a hundred dollars for your meal or something like that, but you paid a solid like five or ten or something. You know, like relax. Like, th this is what you get. It's gonna take a little bit of time. Took my mum to Karen's, dying yes. telling her it was a normal restaurant. Okay. <laughs> yeah, this is amazing. Oh no! <laughs> she, she's horrified. Poor lady. Oh, you can think you're doing my job for me. Um, can I get someone from the right family? 
Okay, so they can go pretty far with these things. Uh, he's like, he's like, I'm coming back here next Tuesday. Let's make reservations on the way out. Birthdays, no problem. I'm definitely gonna go here for a birthday, for sure. See, I like getting roasted too, that's the thing. Like, I would go here, I enjoy getting roasted. I love, I mean, you know, some comments are mean and just heart, like, hurtful, whatever, but like, you know, Timothy Chalamet, if he didn't get cast in Dune, Chris D'Elia's non-famous weird brother. I like them, I like the subtle roasts, I enjoy them. In a restaurant, setting even better while my face is full of meat and i'm chewing dinner and someone's roasting me dream come true i feel like a king at a medieval diner getting roasted i'm sorry i didn't hear your name correctly what's your name i'll come spell it out for you if you want no how about you spell it out now uh I, i'm what i'm saying man is i'll come out there and tell you to your face whoa okay what is your name sir my name is get out of my drive through that's my name Sir, I was asking what time you open. I told you, in 10 minutes. Did you not hear me? Huh, okay, yeah. We gotta see the beginning of that clip, man. Because he's saying, get out of the drive -thru. Maybe, Hey, maybe that is his name. What if that was actually my dude's name on the birth certificate? Like, could you, he's just like, no, that's my name. I'm getting frustrated because that's my actual name. It's get out of my drive through Nobody ever believes me. I'm like, who knows? I don't know. Playing devil's advocate, guys. There's like a, what? comment down below. What percent chance do you think that's his actual name? I give it a solid like 0.001% chance that that is his name. Maybe even less. <laughs> Only in St. Catharines. This man gets angry at the worker because his order took 20 minutes. Uh, this guy was also the only worker in the restaurant and there were others waiting for him. Okay, I'm having a hard time hearing exactly what this guy's saying. Okay, so yeah, not definitely not cool, but I also gotta, you know, shout out a little bit here the freaking restaurant that we're dealing with. Um, why is there only one person working? Like, that seems kind of stupid to me, you know what I mean? Like, I get it, you're in St. Catharines, not a massive place right now, but there's one person working here. First off, they do deserve a raise, probably, for being that only person working. But don't we think that we should have maybe one person in the front, one person cooking the food, or maybe, like, a few other people just around so this won't happen? I'm definitely not condoning my dude's activity here. Like, that is 100% rude, but I'm just saying, that's not how you run a business. <laughs> oh, nice. <laughs> How about you swallow first? Oh my god. <laughs> yeah, he got he got got. He got got. <laughs> he loves it. He loves it. There's never been an experience like this in his life. I love it. I love it. I love it. I his soul is happy. I I could tell that his soul is just like I like that. I like that. Why don't you swallow your food first? He's like, oh, you got me. You did get me. Yeah, that's a thing too. Serving tables, always nice. Complaining about the food as they're eating it and speaking to you at the same time. You're like, okay. Yeah, because I'm not worried about you. I'm Come, on right 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 Come on right here, yeah, Come on right here, 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 if you what? Whoa, whoa, yeah. What do you? Why does she need to go there? She's like right there. I'm right here. You know, like, like, what are you gonna do? <laughs> you know, she's like, I think that whatever you're gonna do when she gets there, uh, you could just as easily do. That's just a logistical thing, guys. Like, I'm just this ain't making sense. You know, this argument's not adding up to me. I'm also going to say that I don't think that that's McDonald's right there, folks. This is a different fast food chain going on right here. But I mean, let's face it, they're all they're all kind of the same. Comment down below. What's your favorite fast food chain, actually? That's a, that's, good, that's a good one. Good thread right there. Lady offered an espresso shot and a full cup of milk and didn't want to pay for a latte. 
Um, okay. Oh, I understand what's going on here. Sorry. No, you're good. <laughs> well, here's the thing, Starbucks. If it's cheaper to get an espresso shot and a full cup of milk and just like put it together yourself and that's what you want, like if it's cheaper to do it that way, then that's kind of your bad. You know, like that's kind of like, well, we need to change the rules here and like make it so that's not the case. Because if I can just order my ingredients separately, I'm, I'm like, that just seems like a loophole to me. You know, that just kind of seems smart. Just because I have tattoos, just because I'm Mexican, you don't think that because I'm white or whatever that you don't have to do with me? Anything to do with your tats or your Mexican? Because I bet you about some old white guy, you'd be treating me with way more respect right now, bro. Bro, you came in here flipping out because something was made wrong. Like, bro, look at this. Some green I mean, ass you know, eggs. Honestly, bro. Green eggs, bro. Camera and act like a Is it, those green? They look that green to me. It's pretty, pretty yellow to me. Just Corporate's kidding. gonna love that, homie. What's oh, your name, though? My name is Joshua Lipa. You're a homie. You must be no who, new here, huh? Why do people, why is that like the, alt, dude, it's like, it's like, you know, I, I'm gonna go to corporate. <laughs> go to corporate, call them, see what happens. I bet they won't even pick up the phone. Good luck, nice try. And even if I do, even if someone does, you know what's gonna happen? They're gonna come down and they're just gonna, uh, oh, listen, uh, Mr. Cheddar, uh, says you, says you swore to customer, what's going on there? And then I'm gonna explain it, they're gonna give me a slap on the wrist and you, and you just go back to work, dude. It's not, it's not, it, firing and hiring is one of the most expensive things a company could do. And even the billion dollar companies, they will avoid it as much as they possibly can. Assuming, of course, you're like, not like if you're like a brand, if you're brand, it's like your first day and you do something stupid, it doesn't matter. But if you've been there for even like three months, that just they'd rather just like, all right, just don't do that again. Simple. Listen, no, listen. No, you don't right, want to give us me our money my back. money back. Just give, give us our me my money back. Give us our money back. Give us our money back. Give me. Look, I got you. Give me. Give me. Give me no, no, we not here. Here, here, here. I don't care. Here, 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 here. Give her our drinks. Give her our drinks. No, start telling me my money. Give us our money. Don't talk to me like that. Give us our. Okay, well, this is not how a deal is done, everybody. Money at? Where's our money? Yes, yes. Give where's our money, money at? You act right in my bro, 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 bro. Just, bro, where is, bro, give us our cash. Give us our cash. You're in the wrong. I have the cops on the You're phone. in the wrong. The cops escort you out. Bro, bro. That's it. All you got to do is give us some narcotics. That's all you got to do. You got to move. All right. There you go. Give us our cash. 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 Give us Wow, okay, well, I mean, like, that's just not how a deal is done here. It's like, you give me what I want. No, you give me what I want. Well, we both have to give each other what we want uh, at the same time, you know? Like, that's how this gets done. I, I mean, like, you guys have seen movies before with, like, drug deals and stuff, and it's like, hey, you got the money? And they're like, yeah, and, like, you got the stuff, and it's like, yeah. And then they, like, exchange at the exact same time, you know? Like, nobody wants to be there, but it's like, that's how you do it. It's like, you can't give me the drink, and without the money, and you can't give me the money without the drink. You know, it's like I, I don't trust you. Come on, man. We got oh, to go. The man. inmates are nine dollars. We got to go, man. Well, I can eat the rest of his money. Go, oh no. No, I want. Oh dear. You're nobody here. So you know, you can say whatever you want. I'm going to the store manager's house. Calm down. You just disrespect the whole store. Listen. 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 You just was back here without a uniform on. You got to get up out the door now. It was wrong. You're on the camera. You're on the camera. So you either go in the camera. The man speaking truth. Or you will do not get next to him. You're not out. Um, you know, I, I, who am I to judge somebody for the choices they make? Uh, but Chris, that looked like somebody who uh, dabbles in the I know I can't say so I'm gonna say, uh, can I say No, I can say, uh, dumpster sugar. Let's say dumpster sugar. Let's go with that. We are out here. We actually This is a rough looking Burger King. Yeah, looks like she may or may not be on the, you know, one of these kind of things, you know. I'm not sure what she's upset about, but the guy, there's a sharp young guy there. Uh, he's fed up, but he's telling her the truth. Whatever she's done, you got two options. You leave now and nothing happens, or if you stay, the police are gonna come and uh, you probably end up going to jail or something because they'll probably find something in your purse you don't want them to find. <laughs> Keep talking. Um, <laughs> for real, keep you talking. guys are funny. Get out of my we love that for you. What is this place? Ooh. Ooh. Like a, she really like out that. here. We really oh, out girl, here. This is real, this is real Karen stuff. I'm literally years old. You guys are 
Well, okay, and that's the thing. That's why we gotta see what happens before these videos, guys, because like people behind the camera right now are like, you did this, you did that, you did blah, blah, blah. And like, if they did do that, like, hell yeah, I'm pulling up my camera, like, screw you guys, like, I hate you now, like, why'd you just do that to me? Over here arguing with me. And how long have you been Lemonade and tea. And does that matter? Because you look like you don't even work, oh, you look good. I'm a business owner, thank okay, you. Well, how, how much dough do you actually make? And y'all wanna throw fit on Lemonade and tea. After calling us, after kicking us out, after cussing us out, after all of that, yes, we will make it a big deal. You named us, you called us every name in the but like is that what actually happened you know why were they doing that that's why that's always my question you know because karen's are like oh you did this to me you did that but they never factor in like well they're doing that because like you were rude as hell because like they, they don't have any self-awareness you know what i'm saying I guess I'm blurring stuff out. It must be some Nazi words. Somebody who uh, dabbles in the. I know I can't say. So I'm gonna say. Uh, can I say. No, I can say. Uh, do you need a test? Do you need a test? Do you need a test? Honestly, that's a that's a new one. That's a that's a that's an interesting thing to say. Usually, what I say when I'm in a moment like that, not that I ever in moments like that, but I usually say, buddy, is there a freaking gas leak in here, buddy? Is there is something wrong in there, guy? Like, he's going to Canadian with it. Hey, can I ask you something, by the way? No, it, it's just that every time I come here, like, at the late night hour, I don't know why you're, like, very, like, it's not even me. Because yeah, I close the window. Oh, no. Like, I'm <laughs> sure you're, like, this way with everyone. You just, like, are very impatient. Like, if, if like, you don't want this job, you don't have to be here. Every time I have you, oh, I shut up, it makes man. me sick. I'm so sorry about that. No, no, I'm, I'm sure you're very you're sorry about me, it. So. I'm sure you're very sorry about it, but you are very sorry. to me every time I come here. I'm so sorry. No, I'm, I'm sure you're not actually sorry. Oh, you're my God. Because, like, wh whatever's happening, or you're being recorded. Oh, so. <laughs> just the, the arrogance, the audacity. Why would you say, every time I come here, Every time I come here, you're shitting me, okay? You're bad. I don't like your attitude, okay? It's bad. If you don't want this job, that is supposed to be one of the worst things. If you don't want this job, okay? You don't have to be here, all right? You can go somewhere else. Yeah, buddy, I probably, the kid probably needs a job, dude. He's got to pay for million dollar college tuition in the freaking, stop, dude. Stop, that's so ignorant, stop. Of course, nobody, want, nobody wants that job. Wait, come on, come on, man. Use your brain cells. All three of them, use them. Oh, stop laughing at them. Refund me my money. Refund me my money. You're violating customer service, dude. Refund me my money. Refund me my money. You hung up in my face when I asked to speak to your manager. Okay. Okay. Go call, call whoever you need to call. See how crumbled? You crumbled up. I don't okay. care if it was ripped up. It's no, you're the one who did it. Well, I feel like people have kind of gotten off on, on the on the phrase. It's like, oh, the customer is always right. So then they're you know, the customer, and they just feel like they can get away with anything. And like, that's just not the case. Dude, dude, you're going to give me my stuff. You're going to give me my stuff. I did what the requirements. I'm sorry. Okay, now, okay. But you, being too disrespectful, three, you don't try to talk down. So when I'm, I'm being disrespectful, that means yeah, I don't have right. the right to get yeah, my money told back? You. Okay. Oh, hush. Come Police, call the police and so they can come give me my money back. Hurry up. Hurry up. Do your job. Do your job. Do your job. Sandwich boy. Wow, this is really what this is? Wow. All right, I mean, like, I hear, I do, I do hear what my guy's saying. Like, if she came in, she was just like rude as holy hell. Like, I don't care that I work at Subway. Like, I don't care this a minimum wage position. I don't care that it's like whatever. It's like, you can't treat me like garbage and expect to get away with it, you know? Sorry, no refund for you. Um, excuse me, I actually hate that color. It is disgusting. What? <laughs> then come back in two weeks. That's wow. Okay, I'm gonna assume that was also fakey, fakey because I don't know. I see. I don't get my nails done. I, sh I probably should though. Uh, but th there's a weird part of me that's like, 
the nail industry or the cosmetic industry, there's something like there's the service of it is so weird. Cause like if they're doing it, and you don't like it while it's happening. It's like, what do you do? What do you say? I don't know. Cause I, I don't know. It's so weird to me. You know what I mean? Hey, Taking my Irish friend who has I never love this trend. Oh my God. To eat. <laughs> <laughs> I'm so stressed. Why, why is he rolling you the honey? Oh, <laughs> oh my gosh, I love this. <laughs> I love. I, okay, I remember the first, no, second time I went to Scotland, because I was opening up the drink. Hey, hey, I went to a bar, and it was like a speakeasy type thing, and some guy with a, you know, cool spy mustache came around, like a bookshelf or whatever, with like a cool drink. He had like a glass thing, and he took it off, and it was all smoky, and he was like, mm, he, with this sh and he put it down. And then it was like, kind of like a, a rude restaurant like that, too. Like, he ordered, and he was like, go f yourself, or whatever. I don't know, I'm not gonna do the accent, because I don't wanna get canceled, but. It, a lovely accent, the Irish accent, any accent accomplished, I don't know what I'm saying. But the accent definitely makes it um, funnier by, any, by every mean. On video, what's your name? I don't give a on video. This ain't the first time I've been I on video. You just cussed at me and you're working. Why? Okay. We're, yeah, we're, 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 we're really bad. That's the thing, though. You can't do that. So I don't give you a. You can't do that. I don't give a. Yo, yo, yo. Okay, my dude has definitely had it up. That is the breaking point. Yo, can't like, do nah, this you can't do that. that. So you get the out of here. Whoa. Man, you're going to lose up. I hope you know that. I don't give a. This on video and corporate's gonna see it. The it. video. You're gonna, you're gonna, you're the gonna, video. it's going all over. And let's face it, the people in the car are probably right. He is gonna lose his job for this because you can't do that. No matter what they said to you, unless unless they like violated you or hurt you or something like that, you cannot be saying things like that. You know, your boss is gonna have your back right up until they're not. And that did not paint you in a good light, my dude. So I hope that you had had enough because uh, regardless, that's probably your last day. So the first thing is I touched the oh, lid boy. when I was putting it onto the drink. Um, there's a no oat, oat, oat milk. milk. We didn't oh have oat milk. man, that seems triggering. I should have foresaw the shortage, and I should have been growing those oats in my backyard, milking them on myself, Definitely. and bringing it to work. That was also my yeah. bad. Yeah. Yeah. Um, this person asked for black coffee, so I didn't put cream or sugar in it. Um, milk for ice, it shouldn't taste more milky. Didn't put and cream or sugar I should in just black made coffee. It to the way they wanted, mm. like that was also my bad. Uh, the shaken espresso wasn't layered since they asked for no ice. Right. Ads. I guess I should have defied the laws of density and just. Made it so that it was layered. I don't know how to do that, mm -hmm. but I should have learned. So that's also my bad. I'm trying better now. Yeah, you should be, man. I cannot believe that you don't have those oats growing in the back. And seriously, when I ask for a black coffee, I expect there to be two cream, two sugar in it. That's what I, I ask for, black coffee, and you don't give me my two cream, two sugar? Come on, man. Do better. Literally, do better. Karens and gentle Karens, it's 9.56. We close in four minutes. So it's time to finish up your food and get the f out. Because it's Sunday night and I want to go to bed. Yeah? I don't care if you're still eating. I don't care if you're still drinking. Go leave us a hefty tip and f off. Yeah? This is amazing. Cool? Great. Sorted. Get out. <laughs> Sorted, right, get out. This is amazing. This is like, also what a hard job to do. Like I can stand here and talk and say things. I have a prompter that I resort to. I react to shit. It's easy, it's fun. There's just lights here, no one's around. This is a hard job. Having to like do this after a shift, also after you've worked a serving shift, still getting on a mic and being in character and being on like a Karen, whatever. Kudos, this is a hard job. Oh, hey, 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 hey. Um, Whoa. Sunday. This I is Sunday. Give me my phone! Nail, nail. I need you to calm down. Call the cat! Call me! Call the cat! Call me! Have a good day. Yeah. Have a blessed day and never come back to my I don't have to! Have a good day. Bye. I'd be calling the police, man. I would be calling out that bluff. 911. We have a crazy woman in our store and we do not want to give her her burger. She's losing it. That's so much energy coming off at once. I understand that maybe you're a little hangry right now. I get it. We've all been there. But that, that is unacceptable, my friend. We cannot be doing that. No matter how good the burger is. Whoa. This is impressive. What? What are these? 
<laughs> this is messed up, dude. That's actually messed up. What is that? Yo. That's impressive as hell. That is impressive as hell. Yeah, they went 100% to deserve a raise and a tip. Like if that was what I saw this going on right now, like boom, tip immediately. Like that, that one was messed up. I don't even know what my guy was doing. He was just like messing with like Play-Doh, but it wasn't Play-Doh, I, I don't even know what it was. That's how crazy it was, guys. <laughs> And like they have to clean their shit up after too. What about me? It's fucking coming. Why what's hot? She's so good. Take a chip and piss off. Hey, the girl, leave a cow and leave a people. Oh my god. I'm going now. I'm going now. I'm sorry. Get out of our shop. That is so funny. Oh, the bed. That is so funny. God. Like, they're good. They're comics. These, uh, they're all comics. They're all so funny. That's like on the spot, roasting people. That is so hard to do. While you're holding a tray of like actual hot food, real food that you have to deliver, that has to be quality, arguably one of the hardest restaurants. And they're nailing it. <laughs> and I'm just like, yep. Oh, this is the best. <laughs> this is so satisfying. I would just want to go and just be a fly. Just be a fly on the wall. Actually, that'd be kind of gross. A fly in a restaurant. It's the last place you want to see flies. I want to just go and just sit at a table. Not even order, just sit and be like, just. Talk that shit. Roast me. I want you to roast me like one of your French girls. Let me eat my soup of the day while you roast me. Can I have the name, please? The number? I don't care you recording me on more. I don't. I, you can I show don't, that I to am. whoever you want. I am. But I'll can I have your name and no. number? I should have knocked that out your hand. Whoa. Whoa. You don't got consent. You can't no, be doing that, bro. No, you not my name. Now show them that. I will show them that. You, you think I give a about this job? No, I don't on more. Now get out my drive you holding on my line. Yo, yeah. I mean, like, right at the end there, he's just like, I don't care about this. Like, get out the drive. I'm trying to do my job. Like, still, not cool, dude. Like, very, very rude and, like, should be saying that. But I, I do understand those feelings, you know? I, I know, I feel like we've all felt that way about a minimum wage position where it's just like, man, like, I don't care about this. Like, please just go so I can keep doing what I gotta do. Like, this sucks, you know? Uh, I, I feel like I, I feel like I've had enough at some point. So, I, I kind of understand that. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh man. Where can I find her? Literally, where can I find her, man? Like, oh man, my girlfriend's gonna hate this, but like, come on. Like, come on. <laughs> right? Like, th this doesn't come along every day. Oh my gosh. Like, like, tell me that's not impressive, Chris. Like, tell me that you don't want to be like, here, honey, like, can you help me open my beer? And she's like, boom, bang, bang, bang. I'm just like, oh my God. That's like, I love you. I decided. Can I have the name, please? The number? I don't care you recording me on more. I don't. I, you I don't. Oh, I, I, these drive through ones always get me. I should have knocked that out your hand. Oh, mom, because you don't got consent. No, you're not getting my name. Now show them that. I will show them that. Oh man, my dude is not having it. No, I don't, I'm on. Now get out my job, you holding on my line. Literally, it's like, I just don't care. <laughs> you know, it's like, my dad's just like, I don't care about this. I, I just need to make a little bit of money on the side. This is it. You know, so it's like, and you know, honestly, it's like, if you're working at the drive-thru, like, you could probably get another job working at another drive-thru. So, you know, there you go.